Hello friends and his funky play brothers and please remember to subscribe to our YouTube and today I'm unboxing and reviewing Magic the Gathering Fallout cards collector's booster pack and it says it has rares and foils inside and they're hard the booster packs are hard to find on the back here it says scavenge the wasteland's most special cards the vault is open these booster these boosters are so overstuffed with perks from Fallout uh, fans, they'll test the limits of your carrying capacity. Except to, expect to encounter rares and or mythics, traditional foils, extended art cards, and showcase pit boy or and a borderless vault boy frames. You may also spot a few gleaming surge foils or scrounge up a ser uh, serialized bobblehead card if the super mutants don't find it first. And now let's um, open it. There's Nuka Girl and Nuka Colas. Let's see. And there, that's what it comes in. One booster pack, which looks full of more than just 15 cards. We got. An iBot. Island. Uh, Power Armor. Raider. Super Mutants. Temple. Vertebird. People. Strong Back Perk. Death Claw. Another. Oh, Eddie. iBot. Mystery. Codsworth. Gayo Guai and a Planet of the Apes reference. <laughs> this Planet of the Apes reference Fallout card is my favorite one because it looks funny. And then this Yeo Guai Pit Boy one also looks cool. Now I'd rate this pack a 10 out of 10 because it has a few cool cards. Uh, there's also this. Oh, it's a double-sided card. So there's a bottle caps on this side and eyeball on this side. That's cool. So 10 out of 10, two thumbs up. Pretty good booster pack. Uh, hopefully we get more rares. I don't know if this one's a super rare one or not, but I think it's super funny and cool. So friends, thanks for watching. Like, comment, subscribe, hit the notification bell. Follow us on social media at the Funky Play Brothers and Funky Play Bros. Support our cash app at the Dogs and Funky Play Brothers. Thank you for watching. Bye.